The two types of people that drive narcissists crazy. Everyone. Today, let's explore the complex nature of narcissism beyond standard definitions. We're familiar with traits like selfishness, entitlement, and a lack of empathy associated with narcissists. However, we want to delve deeper into the less conventional aspects that truly capture the experience of dealing with these individuals. A key theme we'll be examining is intolerance. Narcissists often struggle to embrace anyone with beliefs, preferences, or life interpretations that differ from their own. In this discussion, we'll unravel the layers of intolerance, concentrating on two specific categories of people that pose challenges for narcissists. The initial category comprises individuals representing diversity, those with varying opinions, values, and lifestyles. For narcissists, diversity triggers an unwillingness to accept differences, fostering an I-can't-tolerate-that mindset. The second category involves individuals who speak the truth. When someone confronts a narcissist with honesty, pointing out errors or misinterpretations, the narcissistic individual finds it intolerable. Stay tuned as we dissect these layers of intolerance. I'll also introduce a third type of person that narcissists struggle to tolerate. If you're eager to explore the intricacies of narcissistic behavior, remember to subscribe, like the video, and share your thoughts in the comments. Your engagement plays a vital role in building a supportive community. Before we delve into the content, I want to express gratitude for being part of our community. Your support is invaluable. If you've enjoyed our content and wish to contribute to its growth, consider supporting us on Ko-Fi. Your generosity enables us to produce more engaging content for you. Regardless of the size of your support, it means a lot to us. And for those joining our membership program, we have an exciting perk for you. Your name will be featured in our upcoming videos as a token of appreciation, a small way to recognize and celebrate the fantastic individuals who make our work possible. Let's unravel the intriguing world of narcissism and explore the personalities that really get under their skin. First person they can't stand, the diverse one. When examining the dynamics of relationships with narcissists, it becomes evident that the first type of person who tends to drive them crazy is someone who differs from them, especially in terms of beliefs and opinions. In the presence of such diversity, narcissists struggle to adapt. Instead of viewing diverse individuals as opportunities for personal growth and learning, narcissists often default to a transactional mindset. They assess the worth of others based on their alignment with the narcissist's views, dismissing those who don't conform to their perspectives as seemingly useless. This transactional approach highlights their reluctance to engage on a personal level and their preference for interactions that serve their interests. Moreover, narcissists exhibit a significant aversion to empathy when faced with diversity. Rather than appreciating the opportunity to understand alternative viewpoints, they interpret differences as a form of rejection. This interpretation reflects a certain level of psychological laziness, as narcissists are unwilling to invest the effort required to comprehend and embrace diversity. Instead, they retreat into a narrow comfort zone, expecting everyone else to conform to their preferences. This attitude leads them to become overly critical, bossy, judgmental, and generally challenging to be around, as they prioritize their own comfort over the potential for personal growth through diverse interactions. Second person they can't stand, the truth speaker. In dealing with individuals who embody narcissistic traits, it becomes evident that they struggle with embracing truth, especially when it contradicts their self-centered worldview. The concept of a truth speaker, someone who fearlessly points out discrepancies and challenges the status quo, becomes particularly unsettling for narcissists. It's not merely a matter of desiring correctness. It's about craving the status of being the ultimate standard of rightness. The very idea that there could be alternative perspectives or responses to life events is rejected, showcasing their closed-mindedness. When faced with a challenge to their version of truth, narcissists tend to go on the defensive, prioritizing the need to be right over embodying goodness or maintaining an open mind. Navigating interactions with such individuals proves to be a challenging journey, 
as they adamantly invalidate and argue until their counterpart is left exhausted, with little room for personal growth on the narcissist's part. Amidst these challenges, understanding the dynamics at play and seeking solace in valuable insights from various sources, including psychological and philosophical perspectives, can be beneficial. Recognizing the limitations of narcissistic behavior and its impact on personal growth is crucial. In moments of frustration, it becomes essential to explore ways to protect one's mental well-being, seeking guidance and support from reliable sources. Additionally, delving into broader discussions on the nature of truth and openness in various contexts, beyond the immediate scope of dealing with narcissism, can offer a more comprehensive understanding of human interactions and personal development. Third person they can't stand, the love-immersed one. Being someone who embodies the essence of love involves a profound understanding of its true meaning. Narcissists, however, fall short in grasping the depth of love's authenticity. Their professed love often carries a significant flaw. It lacks the capacity to embrace diversity or allow for the expression of personal truths. Genuine love transcends the ego, a concept that narcissists find challenging due to their inherently self-centered nature. Love, in its truest form, extends beyond the desire to be right. It encompasses freedom, patience, kindness, and the acceptance of imperfections. In stark contrast to the nurturing qualities of love, narcissists are consumed by the pursuit of projecting a flawless image. The essence of love thrives on inner peace, a state of being that eludes narcissists as they carry a burden of internal chaos. Their approach to self-worth revolves around diminishing others to elevate themselves. Unlike the positive reinforcement that fosters healthy self-esteem, Narcissists derive their sense of worth from putting others down, a strategy that not only fails to provide genuine self-esteem, but also perpetuates a cycle of negativity and toxicity. In essence, understanding the dynamics of interactions with narcissists involves recognizing their aversion to diversity, truth, and love. Their rejection of individuals who champion these values stems from the inherent clash between narcissism and love. If you find yourself among the ranks of those advocating diversity and truth, and the narcissist in your life distances themselves, it may be a signal to reconsider your association with such individuals. Don't forget to subscribe for ongoing insights. And if you're grappling with the complexities introduced by narcissists, I'm here to offer support as you navigate this transformative journey. Narcissists, by nature, struggle with tolerance, and often reject the principles of diversity and truth. In light of this, forging connections with individuals who embrace tolerance can prove to be a more rewarding path. This shift positions you as a positive influencer, contributing to a harmonious environment for both yourself and those around you. To delve deeper into these concepts, explore the resources available, including our free book, and consider the option of a one-on-one -on -one consultation as mentioned in the description. Remember, your personal growth is paramount, so be sure to hit that subscribe button to stay connected and access a continuous stream of empowering content.